Welcome everyone, back with the latest time trial video, where I go through my best lap, and show you if I'm able to get gold, driving in automatic, and hopefully show other drivers who attempt this in automatic, that if I was able to be fast enough, then it can be done. Sometimes, I'm not fast enough, or the elite drivers make the gold target out of reach, and I'll have to switch to manual, I'll showcase those laps in these videos as well. I do all my driving on controller, and in time trials, I drive with assists on, which are counter steering, ASM, ABS, and traction if needed. I'm also using the braking area, apex markers, and chasing one of the leader's ghost. The second part of this video will be the chase cam view, so you can see the full position of the car through turns as I'm driving. With all that being said, let's jump right into the lap and show you how I did. This week's time trial is at Dragon Trail Gardens Reverse in the 1997 BMW M3. Traction is set at 2 in the M3. Turn 1, I use the 150 board and start braking just right before it, let off at the end of the area, let it coast to the outside apex, then slowly get back on the throttle and try not to go over the curb like I did. Here I use the second Michelin sign and start braking around this point, let off as I pass the area, let it coast, tap the brake on the next area, coast again, I did have to tap the brake again, then slowly back on the throttle till full around the last section. For this right, I use the overhead sign, let off at the end of the area, keep it tight, and then just lift going around the next turn. Here I use the 100 board and brake a bit before it, around this point, let off as I pass the end of the area, could have been a little tighter, and slowly back on the throttle on the exit. For this section, I use the beginning of the curve, but you can also use the 100 board, let off as I pass the area, over the sausage, then a quick tap on the brake, and unlike me, Try to go over the second sausage too. Final bend, you just need to lift. I use this red bar, which is either the fourth from the start or the third last one, then back on the throttle when you see the inside curb or the last tree behind the barrier, and avoid going over the curb like me. After putting this lap together, I was able to only shave off a little time from my previous record to get a 150, 359, was hoping to get into the 149s, but I'm just not skilled enough for that. Now I leave you with the chase cam view, hope this video can help all my fellow automatic drivers get themselves that gold. Please like, comment and subscribe, your support is greatly appreciated, thank you, and see you in the next video.